In the vast landscape of spiritual exploration and personal growth, the concept of vibrational frequency plays a pivotal role. We often hear about the importance of raising our vibration, aligning with higher energies, and surrounding ourselves with positive influences. However, the narrative around low vibrational people, those who seem to exude negativity, pessimism, or despair, is often shrouded in misunderstanding and judgment. In this video, we aim to unravel the complexity surrounding low vibrational, people shedding light on their characteristics, the impact they have on our lives and the profound spiritual lessons they offer by understanding and compassionately engaging with low vibrational people. We can enhance our own spiritual journey and contribute to the collective elevation of consciousness. Understanding Vibrational Frequency High vibrational frequencies are associated with positive emotions, such as love, joy, and peace. While low vibrational frequencies correspond to negative emotions like fear, anger, and sadness, each person radiates a unique vi, brational frequency which can fluctuate based on their thoughts, feelings, and actions. High vibrational people tend to attract positive experiences and relationships, while low vibrational people often find themselves in a cycle of negativity and hardship. Low VI vibrational behavior often conceals deeper underlying reasons that contribute to an individual's state of being. Majority of low vibrational behaviors are driven by fear, fear of failure, rejection, abandonment, or the unknown. This fear-based conditioning often leads individuals to avoid risks, cling to comfort zones and resist change thereby limiting their personal growth and spiritual evolution. Living in the past, living in the past past, is a common trait among low vibrational people, often manifesting as an inability or unwillingness to move forward from past experiences. This behavior can stem from unresolved trauma, unhealed emotional wounds, or a deep-seated fear of change, and the unknown people who dwell on past events are frequently stuck in a cycle of regret, resentment, and nostalgia, which prevents them from fully engaging with the present and embracing future possibilities individual UO. Living in the past often replay old memories and experiences. Whether positive or negative in their minds, they might ruminate on what they could have done differently or cling to past successes and relationships as if they defined their current identity. This constant reflection can become a significant obstacle to personal growth and development. Living in the past is typically accompanied by a range of negative emotions such as regret, guilt, anger, and sadness. These emotions can create a heavy inner, getic burden lowering one's vibrational frequency and attracting similar low vibrational experiences, lack of gratitude. Lack of gratitude is another characteristic commonly observed in low vibrational people. Gratitude is a powerful emotion that elevates our vibrational frequency, aligns us with positive energies and fosters a sense of abundance and well-being. Conversely, a lack of gratitude. Keep individuals trapped in a mindset of scarcity, dissatisfaction, and negativity. People who lack gratitude often fail to recognize and appreciate the positive aspi. CTS of their lives they may take their blessings for granted focusing instead on what they lack or what is wrong. This mindset creates a perpetual sense of discontent and prevents them from experiencing joy and fulfillment. Gratitude acts as a magnet for positive experiences, while a lack of repels them when individuals do not express gratitude, they emit a low vibrational frequency that attracts similar low-frequency experiences and relationships. This can result in a cycle of negative events and interactions that reinforce their feelings of lack. And dissatisfaction scientific research has shown that practicing gratitude has numerous health benefits, including reduced stress, improved sleep, and enhanced mental health. On the contrary, a lack of gratitude can contribute to chronic stress, anxiety, and other health issues, further lowering one's vibrational frequency and overall well-being, always blaming. Always blaming others or external circumstances for one's problems is a significant marker of low vibrational behavior. This mindset stems from a lack of personal responsibility and an external locus of control 
where individuals believe their life's outcomes, are determined by factors beyond their control. People who consistently blame others avoid taking responsibility for their actions, decisions, and emotions. They may attribute their failures, disappointments, and hardships to other people, societal systems, or unfortunate events. This mentality creates a victim mindset where the individual feels powerless and perpetually wronged. Blaming others is often rooted in deep-seated fear, insecurity, and low self-esteem. It serves as a defense mechanism to protect O. Oh, Nay's ego from the pain of acknowledging personal faults and shortcomings, however. This behavior prevents individuals from learning from their mistakes and growing emotionally and spiritually moving away from a blame mentality requires a shift towards personal accountability and empowerment. This involves recognizing one's role in creating and influencing their life circumstances, practices such as self-reflection, seeking feedback, and developing emotional intelligence can help individuals take responsibility for their actions and reactions, ignoring the inner. Compass ignoring the inner compass is a significant behavior seen in low vibrational people manifesting as a disregard for their intuition and inner guidance. The inner compass or intuition is an innate sense of direction and wisdom that guides us toward our true path and purpose. It aligns us with our higher self and the universe leading us to make choices that resonate with our authentic being. People who ignore their inner compass are often disconnected from their intuition. They may doubt their inner voice or dismiss it entirely, relying instead on an external validation and societal norms to make decisions. This disconnection can stem from past experiences where their intuition was invalidated or from a fear of trusting the unknown. When individuals ignore their inner compass, they may find themselves making choices that lead to dissatisfaction confusion, and misalignment with their true purpose. This can manifest as unfulfilling careers, toxic relationships, and a general sense of being lost or stuck in life over time. This can lower their vibrational frequency and contribute to a sense of despair and far. Illustration embracing the inner compass as a reliable source of guidance can empower individuals to navigate life with greater confidence and clarity. The Mirage of Material the mirage of material refers to the illusion that material possessions and external achievements are the primary sources of happiness and fulfillment. Low vibrational people often fall into this trap, believing that accumulating wealth status and possessions will solve their problems and bring them lasting joy. This mindset can lead to a perpetual state of dissatisfaction and a knee, ver-ending pursuit of external validation, the belief. That material success equates to happiness is deeply ingrained in many societies. People may chase after money, luxury items, and social status, hoping these external markers will fill an internal void. However, this pursuit often leads to temporary satisfaction, followed by a lingering sense of emptiness and unfulfillment. The constant chase for material gain can lower one's vibrational frequency as it is driven by desires rooted in ego, fear, and insecurity. This focus on external achievements can overshoe, add out the importance of inner growth and spiritual development, leaving individuals feeling disconnected from their true selves and the deeper aspects of life. True fulfillment comes from within through experiences of love connection, purpose and self-awareness by shifting focus from external to internal sources of joy. Individuals can elevate their vibrational frequency and find lasting happiness. Breaking free from envy and jealousy. Breaking being free from envy and jealousy is essential for raising one's vibrational frequency and fostering positive relations. IPS envy and jealousy are low vibrational emotions that stem from feelings of inadequacy, insecurity, and comparison. These emotions can create barriers to personal growth and happiness, leading to strained relationships and a diminished sense of self-worth. Any and jealousy arise when individuals compare themselves to others and perceive themselves as lacking. This can be triggered by others, successes, possessions, or qualities that they desire for themselves. These emotions are often fueled by deep-seated fears of not being enough or not having enough envy and 
de-jealousy can lead to destructive behaviors such as gossiping resentment and sabotaging others' success. These actions create negative energy and can harm both the individual, experiencing these emotions and those around them. Additionally, living in a state of any and jealousy lowers one's vibrational frequency and attracts further negativity into their life. Breaking free from envy and jealousy requires cultivating self-acceptance and an abundance mindset. Recognizing one's unique strengths and qualities can foster a sense of self-worth and reduce the need for comparison practicing gratitude for one's own. Blessings and achievements can also shift. Focus from what is lacking to what is already present and abundant. Clinging to pain. Pain identity. Clinging to pain, identity is a behavior where individuals define themselves by their past, traumas, hardships, and negative experiences. This identity becomes a central part of their self-concept, influencing their thoughts, emotions, and actions, while acknowledging and processing pain is crucial for healing. Becoming overly attached to a pain identity can hinder P.I., Arsenal growth and maintain a low vibrational frequency pain. Identity of forms as a coping mechanism to make sense of difficult experiences, people may repeatedly tell their story of suffering to themselves and others, reinforcing the belief that their pain defines who they are. This identity can provide a sense of familiarity and justification for their current struggles. Holding on to a pain, Identity can prevent individuals from moving forward and embracing new possibilities. It can lead to a victim mentality where they feel powerless to change their circums. Tances this attachment to pain can attract further negative experiences perpetuating a cycle of suffering and low vibrational energy. Compassion and Boundaries Compassion and boundaries are integral to navigating relationships with individuals exhibiting low vibrational behavior. These principles promote empathy, respect, and self-preservation while fostering healthy and supportive connections. Approach individuals with compassion, recognizing that their behavior may stem from pain, fear, or unmet needs. Listen actively, suspend judgment, and offer support without enabling destructive patterns. Compassion fosters understanding and creates space for healing and transformation. Establishing and maintaining boundaries is essential for protecting your energy and well-being. Practice saying no when necessary and prioritize self-care to prevent burnout and resentment while it's important to offer support and understand understanding. It's equally crucial to prioritize your own needs and emotional health. Honor your intuition and trust yourself to make decisions that align with your values and highest good. Transforming low vibrational relationships, transforming relationships with individuals exhibiting low vibrational behavior requires patience, empathy, and a commitment to personal and collective growth, while not all relationships can be transformed. Approaching them with compassion and intention creates opportunities for healing and understanding model positive behavior and a high vibrational mindset. In your interactions, demonstrate empathy, integrity, and resilience. Inspiring others to embrace similar qualities and values, encourage individuals to engage in self-reflection, personal development, and healing. Practices offer resources, support, and guidance to empower them on their journey of self-discovery and transformation. Foster open and honest communication about feelings, expectations, and boundaries. Create a safe space for individuals to express themselves authentically and address underlying issues that contribute to low vibrational behavior. Maintain a sense of detachment from outcomes while remaining compassionate and supportive. Transcending low vibrations in conclusion. Understanding low vibrati. Ono people goes beyond surface judgments. It requires compassion insight and a willingness to see beyond behaviors to the deeper reasons driving them. These individuals often grapple with unresolved emotional wounds, limiting beliefs and fear-based conditioning that keep them stuck in cycles of negativity. By recognizing the hidden reasons behind their behavior, we can cultivate empathy and offer support without compromising our own energy and well-being. Protecting our energy. 
Raising our vibration and setting compassionate boundaries are crucial for Na. Vigating relationships with low vibrational individuals while honoring our own growth and spiritual journey, ultimately embracing these insights allows us to transform challenging interactions into opportunities for mutual understanding, healing, and spiritual advancement.